Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Morgan. And I'm Brendan. And, and welcome, welcome to Bash, Bash TV. TV. Today is April, Wednesday, April 27th, making today the official 156th day of school on day two of the cycle. The lunch menu for today will be turkey, bacon, croissant, sandwich, peas, fruit, and milk. The breakfast menu for tomorrow will be cinnabar, fruit, assorted juice, and milk. Prom tickets are now on sale in the guidance office. Tickets are $40 and include a full dinner, which will be served at the ballroom, plus your entrance to the dance immediately following dinner. The deadline to purchase prom tickets is Friday, May 6th. Students who would like to bring a guest from another school district to the prom must complete a guest pass and submit it to Mr. Bennett in the front office by Friday, May 6th. All guest passes must include a photo ID. That's it for main desk. Let's send it over to Graham and Jack to hear more about the color run and powder puff. Student Council will be hosting a color run on Friday, May 13th. Students must have a minimum of $25 in donations to participate. There will be a white color run t-shirts available to buy for $6. Students participating in the event will be excused from school at 1.08 p.m. Student Council is also hosting a powder puff football game for junior and senior girls. Students must have their $15 for their shirt before they are able to sign up. The event will be held May 15th. Sign-ups for both the color run and powder puff will be held in the cafeteria during lunch this week. It's going to be a lot of fun. Everyone should participate. Yeah, these are really cool events. Sign up as soon as possible. Now let's send it over to Tyrone with sports. Thanks, Jack. Thanks, Graham. I'm Tyrone. Let's take a look at everything that's going on with sports. On Monday, in varsity baseball, Braden Boone and Gabe Ebenson both had singles for Berwick in a 2-1 to -one win over Crestwood. Luke Solt also hit a ground ball and an errant throw. Home resulted in Alex Peters scoring the winning run. In varsity softball, the girls captured a 2-1 to -one victory over Nanticoke. In the night sports, varsity baseball is away with Tuntanic at 4.15 p.m., dismissal 1.30 p.m. Junior high baseball is home with Crestwood at 4.15 p.m. Junior high softball is home with Wilkes-Barre area at 4.15 p.m. Varsity track is away with Lake Lehman at 4.30 p.m., dismissal 2 p.m. Now over to FYI with Danny Deans to see what's happening around BHS. Thanks, Tyrone. I'm Danny Dimes, and let's get started with FYI. Applications for summer employment with the Berwick Area School District are available in the guidance office. Completed applications are due on April 29th. The YMCA has a volunteer opportunity available as a summer day camp counselor in training. As a summer camp CIT, you will inspire youth and foster enrichment in our community, lead weekly adventures and outings all summer long, and explore nature and all our beautiful area has to offer. Apply in person at the Berwick YMCA. Volunteers from the Art Club and cheerleaders are needed for West Berwick Elementary School's Spring Carnival on May 13th from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. Interested students should sign up in the guidance office. The Teen Center is hosting a free movie, Cyberbully, at the Berwick Theater on Wednesday at 6 p.m. The center will close early, 5 p.m., to get ready for the movie. Your free ticket will include a small popcorn and drink. Bring money if you would like to purchase candy. Well, that's it for today's episode. To conclude, we'll leave you with the birthdays. Happy birthday to Leah Custer, Sadie Myers, and Jackson Smith.